so I am vlogging right now because a couple days ago Eileen was nominated for prom queen. <gasps> they're here, they're here, they're here, they're here. They're here. Eileen, go outside. I Put mean, some clothes on. <laughs> I heard the doorbell ring and my mom comes in my room and she's already filming me. And I'm like, okay, what's going on? Hi. Hello, Eileen. Oh, my God. <laughs> yes. So, as you can tell, I am the Kim K of the family today. I'm just kidding. Um, so, I decided to get ready today. I just woke up and was like, girl, do your makeup. So, I do my makeup. Lashes from Alaglamour Lashes. Um, and now I just like don't know what to do. Like, I just get ready for no reason. I'm kind of hungry, actually. Let's just see what the hell my mom is making. I do make my own food here at the house a lot, but sometimes you just want your mom to baby you and make you food. So now I have to go check on my mom and ask her what she's making for lunch. What? It's supposed to say come in. Hello? Hey. Girl, what are you doing? I was just trying to take a nap, girlfriend. Um, excuse me, miss. It's like two already. Why are you taking a nap? I get tired. I honestly get tired because I don't ask my kids to help me with that. They have other responsibilities. So today I'm taking a break and I need to take my daily nap. That's one thing I do need is a daily nap. Okay. What? I'm hungry. Did you make anything? No, I didn't make anything. Uh, girl. Today, girl, I am not ready to cook. I'm taking a day off. It's up to you, Eileen, to make the food because, girl, I need a break. So what you're saying is I have to go make my own sandwich when you're my mother and you're supposed to make food for us. She's in her zone, so whatever. Now I guess I gotta step it up. Elena, why is everybody like in a mood? Am I the only? Am I the only one that's like perfect in this family? Do you want a sandwich? No. Do you want to make me a sandwich? <laughs> yes. Honestly, honey, I would not let you touch my food. Elena, so what is this little book that you're like into? It's where I write all my secret thoughts, but. Thoughts? Ooh, you thoughty girl. I mean, not thoughts, I mean secrets. <gasps> oh, girl, let's go see what our mom is doing. What in the dungeon is this? <laughs> turn on the light. How do you turn? Oh my god. Bruv, what are you doing? Did you just wake up? Like almost an hour ago. Oh my gosh. Playing video games? No, I'm just on YouTube. Oh my god, bro. Armando is a little in trouble right now, so he can't even play video games. Ricky caught Armando playing video games up to like four in the morning, and you know what? Bye bye controller, because he's not playing video games anymore until further notice. She guys want sandwiches? Girl, I'm fine. Sandwiches like four or something? Yeah, like, oh, like we could. Something. We could order something. Order something. Order something. something. I do miss going out to eat and just being able to not have to make food and just go buy it. I think I miss In and Out the most. Do I really want to risk going outside and going to go eat somewhere else, or can I just make it here at the house? You know. So yeah. Okay, there's honey. Oh, they have butter right here. Put a stick of butter in there. Provolone. Where's the bread in the pantry? No. I don't want it like too, too toasted. So do you want a sandwich or no? Oh my no, God. No, I just want bread. bread. So her like mom and dad, you know, like kind of like pressing you on like going to college. Are you like ready for that? Do you have, do you even have a plan? I just know I want to go to college. I don't have a plan. Like, I don't know exactly what I want to do. I don't know That's fine. like what I want to go to school for. I don't know where. And I think it's like a lot of pressure right now. Big pressure because like everything that's going on right now. I have like a couple of things that I was thinking because you know eventually I'm have to Move grow up. To? Yeah. And um, I don't know. I guess like I just wanted to bring it up. Have options, and I was like thinking, should I continue to YouTube and see like how far it takes me. And if I'll be able to like actually be able to live off of it or should like I get a job somewhere. 
obviously there's college. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. That I can go to, so that way I can like pursue something. Out. You major in something too. And like. I mean, you have to. Think of um. I don't know. I just want to be able to have options. But I feel like it's too soon for me to make up my mind and I don't want to rush into something that I'm not like 100% with, you know? Yeah. I definitely feel like there's like a lot of pressure for me to make a decision about college right now just because time goes by super quick and I'm almost to the point where I have to make my decision. Like I'm kind of forced to make a decision and like I'm graduating soon. So I think I just have to like make a decision, but I just don't know what. So you have to get a job, like what job would you even choose? I mean, I've always like wanted to work with kids, but mm -hmm. I just don't know in what and how. So maybe I think you should be like a teacher. You, you could be a teacher. I mean, you're smart. Mm. Thanks, girl. I'm not too smart. Though. You're good at math. <laughs> uh, obviously, you don't know me. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> about that. How you much money do you want to make? <laughs> how much money do I want to make? No. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna make millions, huh? So millions of dollars. I don't know if they understand the pressure that I'm feeling right now, but they, I, I think I do know that they want the best for me and they want me to like make the right decisions and they want to help in whatever way they can. At the end of the day, they, they want me to be happy regardless. So um, they're, they're being supportive. You're gonna freaking leave me and Elena here by ourselves? Mm -hmm. Yeah. And I have to grow up with a brother. I can't handle it. You're already grow oh up with me. You've, you've dealt yeah. with me for seven years already. I just, obviously, I feel kind of pressured because, like, dude, I'm literally graduating in like a month. Mm hmm, that's crazy. Dude. Like, like, 12 years already. Yeah, like, I have to make a decision sooner or later, but I just don't wanna make the wrong decision. You know, like, I just wanna be able to make a right decision. So I'm able to like everything. actually love what I do. And I'm like, I just need to follow my heart. But I don't know what my heart wants. Ideally for me, I would like her for, for her to go to college and have a plan B. And of course I still want her to do her YouTube, stay motivated, but I'm just concerned that she really doesn't have a plan yet. I'm kind of worried. But you guys, I think we should all get our head in the game. I mean, I already have my head in school. Okay. Okay, cool. Give right. her the claps that right. this girl deserves because she's <laughs> yeah. been doing more than we have. Yeah. She knows what she oh, wants in stop. life and we know. Keep it coming. Keep it coming. Since I am the oldest sibling, I know that Armando and Elena they look up to me and especially Armando because me and Armando are closer in age. I definitely should like set an example for him and graduate and want to go to college and want to do something with my life so that way he, you know, follows my footsteps. Hey guys. Wow. Did you make your sandwiches? Um, good morning, I didn't even see you today. Morning, you know what? what? I woke up early, you woke up late today. He woke up like that's at two. True. Like one no, morning. not even at two, it was like one. Now make sure you guys clean up that mess because that's why mom. Oh no, I'm not doing this. Well, thank you. Because you clean dress? Time to go finish my nap. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Bye guys. Bye. Bye, Bye. Hi guys. So I am vlogging right now because a couple days ago Eileen was nominated for prom queen and guess what? She won! I'm so excited for her. She doesn't know but the school's gonna come and surprise her. Prom queen, baby Eileen. Woo, I'm so excited. So Eileen got nominated for prom queen through her school and it was an online vote and today I got a phone call and I was so surprised and so shook that she won prom queen so instead of telling her I definitely wanted to surprise her okay guys I have an issue Eileen's not ready she has literally one eyelash on half of her makeup and she's wearing booty shorts oh my god I don't even know what to do guys honestly babe what are we gonna do come here yeah Eileen <gasps> they're here they're here they're here, they're here. Broken the phone up, I'm here. Eileen, go outside. <laughs> I really look like um... Eileen, go outside. Okay, we'll put some clothes on. <laughs> <laughs> Eileen, go outside. Eileen, put some clothes on. <laughs> put some clothes on now, Eileen. I heard the doorbell ring and my mom comes in my room and she's already filming me. And I'm like, okay, what's going on? And, it, and then she's just like, get ready, there's people outside. Well, I heard people outside talking. 
and then I like peeked a little bit and I saw people and I'm like, why are there people outside? And Lena and Armando kept coming in, checking on me. My mom was fully dressed and I'm like, what's going on? We're just here at the house. Like, so the vibes were off already. So I started suspecting something. Hurry, hurry, yeah, hurry. Uh, hurry up. Stupid. <laughs> <laughs> okay, wait, hold on you guys. Should I put these um, jockeys on? Yes, just put something on fast now. Hurry up. Hurry up. Oh. <laughs> hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I didn't know how to tell her to get herself ready. Honestly, I didn't even know how to push her to do things without making her get suspicious about stuff. She doesn't have clothes on. Okay, ready? Go. Oh. I didn't even do, I didn't even, I'm not even getting ready at all. Hi. Hello. Oh my God. Oh my God. I had no idea that I was going to walk outside and be crowned prom queen. That was like the most like shocked I've ever been. Yay, prom queen. <laughs> She was definitely very surprised. She was not aware that she had won. So it was a good way I kept the secret. It was really good. And her reaction was so cute and so sweet. Woo! <laughs> Thank you guys. Thank you, Bertola. Thank you guys. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bye. Stay safe, everybody. I leave. You won! <laughs> Come over here, let me see. Yeah, but no, Thank you to everybody who's voted for me. Come on, do I look like you? No. <laughs> you won prom queen! What the heck? Well, Eileen is on track to graduating, and I'm just so proud of her. But yeah, she's graduating. Okay, you can stay up till four in the morning. Oh. <laughs> prom queen, everyone! Congratulations, Brandon! We're queen! Look at Brandon! The prom king is Brandon, which is perfect. I'm so glad that we both went together because Brandon has been like my BFF since like the beginning, like since I started going to school there. And I was just like, who would have thought that we would have went together? Like it was just, it was perfect. Oh my god, I see that. You're so pretty, Ellie. <laughs> Let me see, put it next to each other. What? Let's see. Oh, like, like there you go, prom post. queen and queen. Post. Prom king and queen. Right. <laughs> you right? Oh my god. You're Brandon and Eileen are just friends and they're just so sweet together. I feel like Brandon has been taking a big uh, place in Eileen's life right now. He took her under her wing when she started school and I can see that their friendship just blossomed throughout these couple months that they've been friends. And Brandon is such a sweet boy, such a gentleman, and I'm just so glad that there's someone as sweet as him that's basically like helping her and, and you know, motivating her and just keeping her, you know, happy throughout these months because I see that he texts her and he's always like, you know, are you okay, Aline? How's everything going? So for him to, be, to win prom queen was just perfect. It was like the cherry on top. Congratulations. Thanks, man. Thank you. And I'm going to take some cute pictures when you're done. Yeah. My high school journey has been like interesting to say the least. Like, I feel like I've just gone through like so much. And the fact that like I went from probably being like at the very bottom of like everybody else and just like not in a good place with a bunch of people and then to just being prom queen, like. That is like the biggest high school glow up I've ever seen. Like that is just like the coolest thing ever. I'm so happy that I've got into this spot in my life where I'm just like, I'm just so grateful for everybody around me. And like, yeah, I'm just like so happy. Yeah. Yeah. Red carpet. Oh my gosh, look at you. Let me see a link. No, that dress though. Very cute. Yes, love it. Perfect. Let me see your sign. Prom queen. Smile for the camera, girl. Um, Damn. <laughs> are those earrings? Yeah, they're earrings. You guys, do you like my earrings?
Let me see. A little extra. They're a little bit, a lot extra. <laughs> Bro, I'm tripping. Are they in your chariot? Oh, wait. <laughs> we went ahead and did pictures and she just looks like such a grown girl like I hold myself from crying in front of her but she just looks so beautiful and I'm just so proud of her. If someone were to tell me just like that I would have like all these friends and just like I would be winning prom queen and just like I would be the happiest ever like two years ago I'd be like uh, whatever you're lying just like get out of my face. So like I am like beyond shook that it's like actually happening now like the best thing ever. Hey guys! It's prom day! Today is our virtual prom. For more quince content, make sure to check out Austin awesome TV's new quinceanera channel. Click here to watch my new season.